Hi guys, so for this video I'm using yarn in size 4 medium and the crochet hook in size 5.5 millimeters. So I will start by making a slip knot and then I will chain 37. So now, on the third chain from the hook, I'll make one double crochet. In the next chain, 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 one double crochet. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we have six double crochet plus this turning chain in the beginning of a row. That gives us seven double crochet in total. Now I will chain seven. Now I'll skip the next seven chains so one two three four five six seven and through the eighth chain I'll make one double crochet into the next six chains I'll make one double crochet through each chain We have seven double crochets. I will chain seven. Then I'll skip the next seven chains. And through this eighth chain, I'll make one double crochet. Now, through the next six chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. So I have one chain left because uh, in the beginning of a row I usually make a double crochet through the fourth chain but in this case I made a double crochet in the third chain so I ended up with one extra stitch but that's all right we can just take it apart very easily it's just one stitch see So this completes row one. Now for row two, I'll turn my work around. I will chain three. Then through the next six chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. So again, this three chain, the beginning of row two, plus these next six double crochet chains, give us seven double crochets in total. Now I'll chain seven. Then through his next double crochet chain, I'll make one double crochet. In the next six chains, I'll make one double crochet through each chain. chain seven 
through his next double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet then through the next six double crochet chains I'll make one double crochet through each chain So this completes row 2. Now for the pattern we need to repeat row 2. So we repeat row 2 until our work reaches 62 inches. And then I'll chain 1 and I'll cut this yarn. Now I'll just weave these ends in and we'll be done. easiest scarves anyone can make so this is all for today guys i hope you like this video and thank you so much for watching